back to the cottage on show. So today we're going to tidy up the pantry. So as you can see, I have a very small pantry and I will let you look on the inside. So this is what it looks like now. So we're going to tidy this up and get everything all organized and um, <clears throat> That way we know where everything is. So don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and don't forget to hit that little notification bell so you know every time that I upload a video. So thank y'all so much for watching and y'all have a great day. She said I won't be back in a while. Don't wait. Already packed her bags. Call the cab. May space. And she said I won't answer if you call me when you're lonely I guess I'll let her go, never mind, it's too late But I can't believe I let you slip I think about it seven days a week and this just can't be high the pantry all done, so as you can tell it looks a little bit better Since it's tidied up um, What I have in here are, these are some of my cookbooks that I have And in this little basket right back here it's normally what I keep like my onions and stuff in, just an extra little cake plate. And then the crock pots are from Hearth and Hands and I got those at Target. And these three right here come for $10 and I got those at TJ Maxx. There's one more right there. And then I made the labels off of my Cricut. And then let's see. I think this was, this little container was at Walmart, and then I found this little scoop at Walmart also, and I think this was, I'm going to say $9 or so, but it's perfect like to dip your rice out with, so I love that, and then I think this, that little container, like I said, was at Walmart, I think it was around $5, and then um, I have these containers like this, and I love it because it seals and it keeps your coffee and everything real fresh. And I have some of those. Um, then this little container right here, I got at the Goodwill. And I just changed the knobs out on it. Put that little cute knob on it. Painted this white. And it holds like the little, little snack bars pretty good. And then these little containers like this, I got those at Target. And then the labels come off of Amazon. And then what I use for my scoops is I just use little, little teacups. And so I put those in there and I love that look. So if it calls for one cup, I have one cup in there. And then the baskets I got at uh, the thrift store actually, and they were actually brand new. So this just holds like some of your potatoes or whatnot. And then you can put really anything in there that you want. And then this basket holds my napkins. And then the sides is where I have my canned food and then some of my spices. So, uh, but yeah. And this is the shelf underneath and it holds like my air fryer, some extra cups. And so what I did is I went to Target and I got some blackout curtains. And so I cut those off to kind of fit this little area. And so it kind of hides my air fryer, extra cups, oil, and stuff like that down here that you really don't want to see so you can keep this upper part looking a little bit prettier. <laughs> so anyway, so that is the pantry and maybe you got some ideas if you have a small pantry. Um, like I said, I like to keep it somewhat tidy up so that way I know where everything is. But uh, thank y'all so much for watching and y'all have a great day. But I can't believe I let you slip I think about it seven days a week And this just can't be how it's supposed to end up It's not enough And maybe time will make you fade But I don't know if I'm ready to just let you go away Like my friends think I should Cause what if I just wanna be with you? I don't know what the hell I'm gonna do